actual final itself. So a lot could happen. A lot can happen, and it's been a very fast moving game this year. I've noticed like a lot more fast moving than normal. Like literally within three four days, so much can happen. Mm. Turn on a dime. Do you think Big Brother will try and jig it for a specific person to win? They wouldn't do that, would they? Well, they can do it if they narrow the vote towards yeah, the end and say it's end, between yeah. this one and this one. You were like last time, they wanted like USA versus UK. I know that was the theme, but do you think they would want that again? Or two nemesis up against well, each other? Uh, but yeah, you, it's interesting that you say that. I mm. was thinking that as well. Mm. But the thing is, who are the nemesis yeah, that's a good within point. the house? Are there any? Mm. Let's have a look, yeah, because really, like Tiff and John are friends now. Yeah. Steph's nemesis was Gemma Connors. And Daniela, to a yeah, lesser so extent. There's that, but I can't see those final two, can you? No, Scotty T's not really got one. Darren Day and Tiffany, but that's not going to happen. I would say Darren Day and Stephanie, maybe. They're not really... Uh, They're not, but the way he... Well, it's Scotty T and Stephanie, yeah. definitely, because the way he talks about it is disgusting. Terrible. If those two were in the final mm. two, I can easily see uh, it going Stephanie's yeah, way. Yeah, I can see them fixing that, because they would get a lot of money that way as well. But I think Darren, the way he talks about Stephanie, is a bit disgusting. Yeah, it's, it's not so much what he says, it's, what, mm. it's just the fact he does it by osmosis, by sitting with Daniela and just, like, just slagging her off second hand. I don't like that. Darren is a fake ass minge bag, and you've not got us fooled, not for one minute, Macy. Um, the thing that is, the thing is, right? I don't actually like any of them. Which none, I, none at all. I don't actually even want to vote. I know I will vote, but at this point, I'm so ambivalent towards them. Like I just couldn't care less. You know why? Don't you? Why? Because Jonathan Shaban left. Yeah, that is so true. He should be the winner. And David Guest. Just because Channel 5 couldn't afford a full month's contract. Just because they didn't get that coffee machine in a few days earlier. You dirty, dirty players. I mean, how can you serve beans on toast <laughs> in a house with Jonathan Shaban in it? <laughs> Just... That is disgusting. <laughs> and finally, is this best season ever? Or worst season ever. I was thinking this earlier as well. <laughs> I'll tell you what is definite. I don't think it's as good as last season, the celebrity season. But, to be honest, it's not been bad. It's had some really good bits. It's, but because it's been so good at times, mm -hmm. when it goes slightly dull, yeah. you get bored quickly. But I think that's just quack missed. I think generally speaking, yeah, it's been a good season, definitely. Gemma Collins ruined it for me bad. There was a lot of Deadwood. David Gate was brilliant. T De David, David, Bo David Bowie David oh, right. Guestgate how quickly we forget Tiffany was good for a couple of weeks she's gone a bit off the boil now there's been a lot of good things a lot of interesting things I like the Ste Steph and Jeremy romance to an extent they milked it too much but it was quite interesting but nothing can beat James and Austin and the man's have that was like really compelling interesting television it was but then look about you had Davro mm -hmm. you had J J Janos you mm -hmm. had loads of shit people that year so we never mentioned the food fight where John and Darren kissed at the end and you missed it. I love it when I see, well, not, I was going to say straight men kiss, but one was gay, one is straight. It's just nice. They, they don't do that on American Big Brother. Oh, no, but hang on. What about that nomination that John did for Darren? <laughs> Never forget. It's like the Lest new 9-11, isn't it? <laughs> Darren Day should have that tattooed on his arm or something. <laughs> we're cool. We're cool. Anyway two days to vote vote whatever way you want because we don't really care do we but what is the what is the logical vote there's no strategic vote. there's no hinky there's no strategic vote i think personally if i had to vote for someone just judging by what i'm seeing people saying mm -hmm. i'd just vote for tiffany mm -hmm. because rather her than any of those rather other her than scotty t and if it's like tiffany and scotty t at the end of course we're going to vote for tiffany but I would say, if it's just a, a pure game at the start, if you're a pure housemate and you're voting on behalf of Big Brother Bile because we have no donate button, we have no mugs, we say, vote John just for fuckeries. Hey, girl. What do you think? Yeah. Might as well. Just so he gets, like, third or fourth or something, you know. Yeah. He's not going to win it. Vote, yeah. vote John. Vote Big Brother Bile. His vote mum's John. got Alzheimer's, so... Yeah, come on, have a fucking heart, man. How's he going to get his magazine deal? Um... That's it, I think. I think that is. We will be doing a podcast after the final where we'll be crying. Well, we won't because we don't care. We've not even got a bet on this year because I bet on Jonathan Shaban. So it, it really is the end of day. Oh, should we put a bet on? Then we'll enjoy the final more. No, because all well, the odds are shit now. Let's put, There's only six people there. Let's bet on someone everyone hates. Let's bet on Daniela. That was Crystal Maloney. That was our last chance. What about Darren Day's journey? Could that 
could that win it for us in the end? Fuck, you know, yeah. If all, everyone that drinks tea in the country yeah. votes in, then yeah. If everyone who smokes just forgets their packet of fags and votes for Darren Day. Um, anyway. 50p fo- is like one cigarette now, isn't it? Yeah, that's true, actually. Anyway, follow me on Twitter, light up VM. And follow me, Big Brother Bile. And we'll see you on Friday. Thanks so much for listening. See you woof, soon. Woof, woof, woof. Meow.